Okay, let's go. How do you want to start, Gerard? I don't fucking know. You start, Gerard. No, I don't want to start. Start it. No. Intro this video. Intro it. There's too much dead noise. Or silent. Dead silence. Dead silence. What do they call noise. a video when there's no sound because no one's talking? A video with no, no sound? No, no, no. I'm talking about like when it's, it's like a, they're, they're conver having conversations. They're conversating. Uh, they're having little discussions because they're adults. And then one person's just like, I don't have anything to say. And the other one's like, I don't have anything to say either. So there's no fucking... Awkward silence? No, no. For vi radio, it has a term. It's fucking... There's no people talking. So it's just that. So there's nothing. So it's, it, yeah, nothing. No, it's called though. There's a fucking term for it. I know it is. It's like dead, dead silence, dead, dead silence or something. No, that's the fucking movie with the puppet. What? You, you don't watch movies. Of course not. You never saw that movie with the puppet. Dead I actually silence? did not watch that. Yeah, it's, 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 it's like, a horror movie. It's a horror movie about that explains that. about a, a woman that guy. made puppets. She died and then she kills people when they scream and they she takes their tongues. What the fuck? Yeah. Anyway, Jesus. welcome to our E3 wrap-up show. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Alright, so I'm here with Gerard. Hello. If you, uh... I'm not dead, by the way. No, for people that remember, I used to do a podcast. I'm sorry. I used to do... Yeah, I'm, I apologize. I tried, but... He, he tried. I got out of the hole. You can breathe a lot when I, you know, try to drown him. Yeah, it turns out I have gills. Yeah, he has gills. Confirmed. Oh, that's funny. Um, but, uh, what am I saying? Uh, E3. Oh yeah, that's right. No, I was, I was saying I the podcast. If people remember, a couple years ago, me and Gerard did a podcast called the Gorecast, and which we never had a, another name for. We yeah. originally said that's a tentative name; it will change completely. Never got changed. Never got changed. Well, we did forty-two episodes. What's it? Forty-two. Really we forty-one, maybe. I don't know. Jeez, almost a year. Yeah. Uh, well, we skipped a week here and there. I so. know, but. It's it was more than a year because we a had a, a one year anniversary. I mean, a year, a year. Did we yeah. have a year anniversary? Well, you weren't there. This, uh -oh. this is the thing. Shocking. Like me and me and Gerard started it, and then it became me and other people. Yeah, and I, 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 I love it. It's like me and you started, and for a good chunk of it, uh, we it was just us, and then all of a sudden, oh, one year anniversary. By the way, you weren't there. Yeah, you were there. I didn't yeah. even know that was a you didn't thing. Celebrate. I'm, Don't I'm worry. Just finding out now. It was the worst celebration ever. Anyway, that podcast say. that podcast started to dwindle down. People people liked it for the most part, but yeah. not, not many people watched it. it. It didn't work out anyway on the scenes. But uh, we're gonna start a new podcast next week. Oh shit! Oh shit! News, dude! You got you break! Got... Break! Breaking news! My God! Yeah, my, oh, God. my God! Oh my God! And this is gonna be me and Gerard. Awkwardly talking about hentai and anime. Just like the last podcast, basically. Yeah, remember the last podcast where the first five episodes was all about anime? Yeah. That's fucking it. Oh my god, I forgot about that. Yeah, that's probably what it's going to be about. No, yeah. it's not. Yeah, watch. I'm going gonna... to watch like all of Attack on Titan Season 2 and we'll be talking about that or some you shit. You know everyone's favorite hentai. Oh, yeah. Well, that's... And every anime's hentai. Oh my god. But, um... <laughs> oh god. Uh, I have... I have a problem. Uh, many problems to be exact. Yeah. No, I have a problem. I don't know where I was going with this. And I'm the problem. Yeah, you're the problem. But so, uh, uh, no. this is the, this I have a problem, Gerard. What's your problem? E3 is over. Yeah. Why? Why do I have to live now? What next, next year's E3? I've said this before. I love E3. And I've said this in, in all my reactions for the conferences. Mm -hmm. After this, there's no point of living. It's over. Like, I said, I, the, I said the same thing all with All I Samurai have to say is one thing. What? Can I have your stuff afterwards? No, you can't have shit. Um, <laughs> no, but I even said the same thing for Samurai Jack. Like, what's the point? If you watch Samurai Jack afterwards, you're still doing those react videos. Yeah, I'm still doing that. But, you know, it's after season five. I'm like, what was the point of living? There's no more new Samurai Jack. They finally brought it back and they killed it off immediately. Well, not immediately. Yeah, they did. It was fucking done. That was that was ten episodes. That wasn't immediately. That's immediately. That That's was like eleven two, weeks. A little over two weeks. It was eleven two weeks. months. Two weeks. Two Bobby. weeks. <laughs> two weeks. It was two weeks. They showed five episodes each week. <laughs> Jesus Christ! This is not back in like the nineties and early two thousands when Tanami was on every single weekday. Well, it I wish be, it was. It should be back when they showed a new episode of a cartoon every day for the entire weekday. I miss those days. Yeah, I miss those. Well, you shouldn't be watching cartoons anymore. So. Well, Toonami's still a thing. Toonami's not Coming from the guys like, oh, I'm going to watch season two of Attack on Titan now. But that's not well, cartoons. Well, do reaction videos of cartoons. 
Yeah, but, but Samurai Jack's different. You're watching SpongeBob and fucking. And fucking watching SpongeBob. I don't know. Uh, Henry finds a clue. Or so whatever. are you killing yourself again? <laughs> Henry finds a clue. I don't, I don't even and know what that is. <laughs> Jerry finds a bucket. I don't know. Shit, it's so many you're stupid. making stuff up. There's, there's a bunch of stupid cartoons. Where are we there. going with this? Uncle Grandpa and Senior Jesus and Christ. Senior Sombrero. And senior all those, Sombrero. All those fucking shows you watch. I don't even know like any of them except for like none. <laughs> I don't know any of them except for none. Well, I have no reason to live anymore. E3. So, I had no reason to live anymore, but now we can talk about E3 again and remember the times where I felt alive. Like, during the... That's actually really depressing. Like, the EA press conference and the... and the uh, Bethesda press conference. Uh, (laughs) That's depressing, actually. If that was, like, your hype... your most happiest. I was very... I I love E3. I really do. I I couldn't wait for... E3. E3 uh, is great. I mean, it, they had to start it off with a shit show and fucking dumpster fire, like EA. I but, did not watch it also. Yeah, it was terrible. But um, there was some good shit. I mean, it was, this wasn't the best E3, that's for damn sure, mm-hmm. but it was a pretty good one. It, yeah, it could have been better with some places, but yeah. it was pretty good in other places. All right, so let's just talk about, let's, we're going to start off with uh, EA. Talk, yeah, let's talk about EA. All right, this is not the podcast, by the way, this is the E3 2017. Yeah, we're doing recap. like a recap of it. Recap, and then next week we're gonna start the podcast. What are we calling ourselves, by the way? Should we say it at the end? Uh, yeah, let's save it. Let's save it. Save until, it at the end. Maybe we save it for a surprise next week. Okay. We'll post it. Well, yeah, unless you want to tell them now. I'm. I'm. Whatever you, works for you. We'll save it. Save next it. Week. We'll save it. Just right. we'll just get them excited. It's gonna be really, really cute. Tease them a little bit, and then yeah, be a massive them. disappointment. Yeah, tease them. Yeah, squeeze the nip a little bit, as they say. That's how you tease. All right, Gerard, I know a little thing or two. I mean, I wouldn't, I, I wouldn't know. <laughs> I have the sexy people from the iguana. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> no iguana has ever been sexy, so. No. All right, so EA, I don't have a list of how it went down in order, but I can tell you all of it was shit anyway, okay. so besides one thing. I'm going well, by what you know. two things, but one doesn't really count, which I'll explain in a second. Okay, go for it. All right, so I'm going to explain all the shit. Okay, go for it. I'll, re- I'll try to recollect how it went chronologically okay so beforehand i just want to bring up yes i i did not watch the ea conference uh you did yeah, and did. because of that i'm ju- at this moment i'm just gonna go by what you tell me okay afterwards we can just the other conferences I, we can basically go by both our opinions and impressions of it because i watched the other conferences yeah all right well actually you know what this is this is the best thing that i could do here okay. i'm gonna let you guess how they started the uh, don't, ea press conference don't put me on the no spot it's like that. real easy you can fucking guess it is it fifa no, what's the other one with the foots? What the foots? <laughs> what? <laughs> what's the one mean? that we call football? Oh, Madden. Yeah, they started with Madden. They had like this drum line come in, like it's really fucking like they they had a drum line come in and it said EA Sports. I think it's a Madden on it too, and uh, on the drums. But whatever, that's not important. I'm already bored. The point is, they played that for like two you minutes. You tell me this is just boring enough, God. And, the, and then they zoomed into the screen and it was Madden. And I guess now Madden. Here's the big news, Madden. 18 or 19 or 28 I don't know whatever um, ha- I don't know what year it is but um it comes it's coming with a story mode so if you like story the story mode for what the Super Bowl there's a, no there's a story mode where you like your rise your up and coming football man and you uh, so like you last year ball or so like whatever. EA did last year with their FIFA thing yeah well they did FIFA they did a uh, well, actually, that's 2K. Never mind. EA uh, Games, the most original in terms of storytelling. Yeah, well, they saw that NBA was doing it, the 2K games, and they were like, well, we got to do it. We got to do it, man. Everybody likes that Spike Lee shit. That's a, <laughs> that's a director. Um, all right, so Madden has a story mode. It has a, what's his name from, uh, you never saw Moonlight, right? You've heard of that movie? I think I might have. Yeah, it's about the, the gay kid. Um, about the gay kid? No, he's gay. That's, that's, a, that's what it's about. But uh, the, it has the guy from there who just won an Oscar. He's mm. in it. Um, I don't know. They throw a ball. It's oh, they, they they later on in the uh, press conference they talk about how it's the best looking Madden game, which they say every fucking year. And then when it comes out, it's like eh, it's all right. Yeah. Uh, they like the power of the Xbox Scorpio because they were still calling it Scorpio. Yeah, this Microsoft point. didn't announce it yet. I could be confused this. Maybe they talked about this in the Microsoft press conference, but no, it was, I don't remember this. So yeah, you don't remember this? All right, it was the it was EA one because I, I remember crystal clear the Microsoft yeah. conference. The Xbox Scorpio is going to fucking blow your mind. Look at the, and they show like, not pictures, but like, 3D models of the characters and mm-hmm. stuff as it's rotating and it's like zooming in. Like, yeah. look at the fabric. 
Like, look, look at the shine on the fucking helmet. Look at the ball. Look at the, the, the stitching on the ball. I'm like, come on. It's not going to look that good. If, but, but even if it did, you're fucking like all the way. You're like Diablo style isometric <laughs> Diablo camera. Style. How, when the fuck will you ever see that anyway? <laughs> oh my God. Why the fuck does it matter? Like, it zooms, in, it zooms in sometimes, but it never zooms in close enough. For you're it to not, fucking matter. You're not wrong to say that. And That's it's exactly always the... it always looks like shit anyway. Oh like, my god. Not shit, but it, oh, I mean, is... considering it's an NFL game and all it is is a fucking stadium. That's all they need to do is like de- like model a few stadiums and some and a bunch of characters, sure. Oh, but they god. have the same fucking models they had from last year. They just have to update them, make them look oh, better. God. Maybe switch their jersey number or whatever the fuck. Um, maybe maybe make the helmets look a little shinier, put a little bit more oil on them, make them <laughs> whatever. Um, and the, it, it always looks like a fucking I don't know. It looks like a a couple years back game. Like a game you'd see early this gen. Well, oh, Matt is not sponsoring this video. I don't give a fuck about Matt. He's almost dead anyway. Oh, but uh, that motherfucker's like 85. When is he going to die? I don't know. He's like 112 years old. He uh, might be one of those people who are like 112. He's uh, like, well, all I do is eat raw eggs every day and drink wine. I'm immortal now. Yeah, fucking asshole. Um, those, there are people out there who will claim to do that. Yeah, and then they went on and they did, like, I don't know what they did right after that, but I'm pretty sure it was FIFA. Yeah, most likely. They had likely. a whole thing about FIFA, and they had these assholes called the Men in Blazers or whatever the hell. Oh, they already sound like assholes. They're, they're, they're like these funny, I'm quoting, I got quoting oh, fingers. Oh, no. These funny guys that come out and go like, oh, funny, we're British. We, we had, like, a celebrity guest talk about football, and here's a montage of us um, talking about again, I'm football, just, real football, like, you know. This, I would I would have been, honestly, if I was watching, I would have just been, like, go to Star Wars. Yeah, well, they, oh, don't worry, there's a lot, there's plenty of Star Wars. Good. Don't worry, oh, yeah, yeah, well, maybe not good, oh, but no. <laughs> it, it was something. All right, and then they showed Battlefield 1 trailer, there was a new DLC called The Rise of the Kasai or some shit, I don't know, fuck. Battlefield the, 1, the Battle- Road to World War 1. <laughs> it was called the, um... You had to assassinate Archduke Ferdinand. It was like the rise of the, the Tsar, the, the, I don't know, fuck it, it doesn't matter, it's a new DLC with more maps, and, I mean, I like Battlefield 1, so that's fine, I don't have it, but, you know, I liked it when I played it, but, um, it had that... And like I said, FIFA, yeah, Madden, yeah, NBA Live 18. Every fucking year, NBA Live sucks dick. And there was even like a couple years where there wasn't any because they suck and no one buys them because NBA 2K is better. But um, I guess they're coming out and with another one and they showed like really quick like gameplay. Like, look how good yeah, it looks. I just wonder why. I, they, I get it. EA Sports is a big sports. There's know, a lot of casual people who play sports over. games. Yeah. Just but, like, I'm just going to go quickly to Microsoft for a second. Like, yeah. there's a huge percentage of people who have Xboxes that play, uh, pay Forza. Yeah. Forza? Yeah. Forza. Forza. No, Forza. You don't say pizza. You say pizza. Forza. No, I say pizza. You say pizza? Pizza, pizza. <laughs> Yo, let me get a pizza. Let me get some pizza. Hey, don't look at me, you piece of shit. That's what I say. Yeah. Yeah. Call yeah. me pizza shit. You <laughs> pizza shit. All right. This was, this was a cool thing. I will give them credit here. I think they do this pretty much every E3. Um, EA has this, like, origin, or not an origin, but they have EA Play or something like yeah. that, whatever the yeah, hell it's, it's called. Like, it's like a... EA Access. EA Access, Access. Uh, On Xbox. I think it's coming to PS4, and they get in, like, a free trial or whatever. That's neat. I think it's coming to PS4 as, like, EA Origin Access or something oh. like that. I think it's the same, but it's just different, different name. title. It might have a different title on Xbox also, but I'm not Maybe. sure. But um, there was, like, a free week. I'm okay. sure it's over by now. So that, that was cool. You get to play, like, Mirror's Edge and Battlefront 1 and as much as you want uh, in that one week. So, okay. so you could play up to how many hours are in a week? 24. I'm going to do the math. Oh, God. He's doing math now. Times 7. Uh, 5. Approximately five hours. Okay. Yeah. See, I, I did the math quick. So how you do? All right, so where on. are you going with this? I'm going to the uh, other stuff. I just have to look it up. Okay. They also showed Need for Speed and the new Need for Speed I Payback. Forgot, it's called. I forgot that was a thing. And uh, well, it, it looks like they're really trying to do that Fast and Furious shit. And uh, I don't know if you like Fast and Furious, you might like this one. Maybe. But I will say this: 
they had this guy come out who was this prankster. Oh, this no. YouTube prankster. You, to you be know fair... That's never, you know that's never a good sign when a YouTube prankster goes on an EA thing. Yeah, but to be fair, he wasn't like... Uh, he wasn't those kind of pranksters where he just pranks random people. He supposedly like pranks his girlfriend. His girlfriend pranks him or whatever. Oh, well it's like things. innocent pranks. But he's huge. He's famous. He says with air quotes. Yeah, air, quote, air quotes or whatever. Uh, I do a lot of air quotes. You know, so if yeah. you hear like a little breeze... Back if you ever do a video podcast in like the year 2099... You'll see him do a lot of air quotes. Yeah, yeah, in my in my hundreds at that point. In hundreds. <laughs> uh, but um, what was I saying? Oh yeah, this guy came out. And he was just like, "Yo, I like Need for Speed, fast cars." Um, uh, and you're like, "What the fuck's going on?" Because he was really like going um, and then he's like start smiling. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, oh, did nerves get to him? Supposedly the uh, the because they have a um, what's it called a, pro- a teleprompter to tell him what to say. And I guess it didn't work. I think someone in the audience tweeted that like his teleprompter didn't work because you, oh, could, see, you could see it in the audience. You just turn around, and you see exactly what they're about to say, <laughs> um, and it was it was really embarrassing. And there was even worse stuff. Like, there's a part where he gets one of the developers to come out. It's really awkward. Like, hey, what's up, David or Frank or Kevin? It's a white guy, so it's probably one of those. Um, and he, like, shakes his hand. Uh, and it was like, all right, now let's look at some gameplay of Need for Speed. And he turns around to look at the screen for the gameplay. But it wasn't time to show the gameplay. Oh, my so God. So the developer starts talking about the game more. He's like, so anyway, blah, blah, blah. And then the guy just, like, awkwardly turns back around. Like, oh. So, <laughs> Jesus, I... <laughs> So I'm, he had I'm that. I'm kind of glad I missed it, but at the same time, I'm kind of sad I missed it now. Yeah, yeah, that, that was awkward. But, um, I don't know. Uh, I don't hate that guy. If he was one of those pranksters, then fuck that guy. Yeah. But he's, he's just some guy that this pranks was... Yeah, those funny, people are so. the worst when they yeah, prank people, random people. Yeah, it's not Daddy 05, though. Uh, <laughs> Imagine uh, he brought Daddy 05. Oh, my <laughs> God. <laughs> no. Um... All right, Can I have my kids back, please? <laughs> Can I have my kids back? Oh, no. They said if I had introduced the new Fast and Furious game, they'd, uh, they'd give me my kids back. Jesus Christ. <laughs> this is Need for Speed. Oh, yeah, that's right. Vin Diesel's not in it. Oh, um, no. Anyway. All right, so the last two things were probably, the when it comes to games, the coolest stuff. Oh, by the way, Need for Speed looked all right. No, right. Like, it, it was nice, whatever. I don't care. Mm-hmm. I really don't give a shit about Need for Speed anymore. Like, after the last, like, 14 games, I'm like, I don't give a fuck. Just all give right. me Burnout again. But, um... One thing I will say, uh, yeah, I have to move the chair. Yeah, he's, yeah I have a, I have a beanbag chair. Yeah, this thing is like, I'm, can I move this uh, chair over there? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go ahead. Um, take your stuff off. Yeah, we're gonna pause it real quick. All right, we back. Uh, this is so much better. All right, you had to get a real chair, and not my beanbag chair. Yeah, <laughs> it's right. so. It was. I was positioned in such an awkward way. All right, so the last two things that EA showed, and I'm going to get through these quick because one of them is not even worth mentioning because okay. they showed more of it at Microsoft. Mm-hmm. Um, Anthem, a game Anthem. Oh, I heard you about saw it. Yeah. At Microsoft, right? Yeah, yeah it was the, the game they ended. Yeah, right? it looked pretty good. It looked really good, except they showed it a day prior at EA because it's the EA game. Um, and they showed like this like 20 second teaser where it was just like some woman saying, like, the future. Oh, yeah. we got to get a helmet on. And he puts a helmet on. And uh, I guess they fly. I don't know. I don't remember the teaser. But um, they showed that. I was like, oh, cool. The only reason why I gave a shit is because it was Bioware. Ah. Which are guys that did Mass Effect. And... Yeah. <coughs> Dragon again. Oh, God. Don't die I'm dying. Again. But, um, so that was good. Cool. Whatever. But they showed one game that looks really cool. And we might have to play this, actually, because I'll probably get it. Oh, boy. Don't worry, you don't need to buy it. It'll be a local game, like a local co-op game. Oh, okay. Uh, a Way Out. Did you see that game? Sounds familiar. That It's from the guys that did Brothers of Tale of Two Sons, which is a great game. Mm. It's not a co-op game, but it's a great game. Uh, even though you have to play as two characters at the same time, you use like each thumbstick to control them at the same time. It's it's cool, and it's a really good game. I really recommend it. You should play it. It's actually on like maybe three hours. It's By the short. way, this is not a recap. This is him. This is just a giant ploy to get me yeah, to play more games. Well, this is from the developers of that. So, you know, you should play Brothers of Tale of Two Sons. So. That's a great game. You, I have you won't it. understand you the story otherwise. Yeah, you should stop playing Zelda for at least like an hour and a half. Blast you probably, Yeah, stop playing Zelda for an hour and a half for two days and you can for finish it. For two days. For two days, you know? I, I don't want to take it away from you for three hours in one day because that will probably be too much. But yeah. Half, hour and a half, two days. Come on. You can finish, brothers. You'll like it. Alright. You'll fucking do like you, it. Do you have it? Yeah, I do. What system is for? Xbox One. I'm going to have to borrow that from you then. Okay, yeah. Okay. Watch, well, when, when the mic goes up, you'll be like, I don't want that shit. 
But, um, all right, so A Way Out is kind of like Brothers. Brothers is way more fantasy, though. This is like you are in jail, and you meet up with some other guy. You kind of make friends or whatever. Mm -hmm. um, and you have to break out of jail with this guy. But the, t the trick, the trick the is, trick. the trick is that you're playing, you have to, you have to play co-op. Oh, There's really? no other way to play this game besides co-op. Oh, shit. Um, and one screen is one guy, and the other screen is the other guy. Okay, and so it's split screen. Yeah, so it's split screen, yeah. But um, w one thing that's really cool is that one guy will be doing his own thing, and he'll have to, like, go and, like, set up things to, you know, like, uh, smuggle things out or whatever to okay. get out of jail. And the other guy's, like, I don't know distracting guards or whatever or he's in, even in a cut scene or something there's even a scene where I guess like the new recruits show up not the new recruits it's fucking jail but uh, <laughs> the, new the, new, the new the new prisoners um, the show prison up recruits yeah uh, I guess they just so showed they up the cops are the recruiters yeah the recruit they recruited uh, the bad guys <laughs> but um it's like Suicide Squad oh no except uh, better. even better um but uh, there's even a scene where like they're like getting hosed down in jail and they they're like naked. It's uh -huh. hot. It's, it's real hot. Of course you find that hot. <laughs> oh yeah. But um, and then while that's happening with one character, the other characters are like I don't know doing something. They don't really show off too much of what you do. But there's like even scenes where one guy's driving the car and the other guy's like shooting a gun in the back of the car. So I'm assuming you break out of jail. There's a part like that. Probably. But um. Yeah, no, it looks really, really cool. So that game looks awesome. It comes out next year, though. So EA has fucking nothing this year. Oh, <laughs> my me. God. Until the end. Until the because end. Because, of course, until the end. The end of the press conference. Where they showed Battlefront 2, of course. Here's the problem. This is why I didn't include it in the two cool things. It looks good. They didn't show any single-player shit. They did bring out the girl that plays the main girl. Yeah, I heard that she was actually, like, she brought up, like, she actually was, like, the bright side of the Battlefront but thing. She she came out, and she gave, like, everybody the, I'm gonna fucking kill you eyes. Like, she looked pissed. And I, I, she was trying to be, like, because she's part of the uh, Empire. Yeah, she's... Like, the, the, so she's yeah, supposed like to be all, character. like, villainous and shit. So, she was good. She was good. Everybody in my chat and every other chat was like, oh, I'm bigger. Of she hot. She hot. Would bang. Of but, course, uh, it, it, that, that's exactly what it is. Did they say thick with two C's? Oh, yeah, yeah. Of yeah. course. Extra thick. Yeah, oh, my God. But, um... 13 no. minutes or it's free. Yeah. Well, they said that for the Ubisoft press. Kill Samurai Jack. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I don't know her name. Uh, Qui-Gon, that's her name. Qui-Gon? <laughs> yeah, bring her back. Take the female. mask. Well, it's actually Liam Neeson. Qui-Gon booze. It's like, that's a... Did he, is he actually the chosen one? <laughs> no, he's Darth Vader. What? <laughs> Alright, so they had her up, and she's like, I'm the leader of the whatever the fuck squad, whatever. The fuck squad. And uh, I'm here to introduce Star Wars Battlefront. I'm like, oh, cool. Battlefront 2 single player? Because they brought the single player yeah, girl up. Multiplayer, I'm like, fuck. Course. They showed a little bit of the single player. Like, I mean, like, a little bit. They had a trailer. And I was, was going like, to say, was, was there, like, a cut in the trailer? <laughs> they put a trailer where it was just multiplayer gameplay, obviously. Because you see Ray fighting Kylo Ren and Darth Maul shows up and shit. I'm like, that. Well, you don't know Darth Maul's supposed to show up in episode 8. <laughs> oh, yeah, I can't wait. Come back. Even though Star Wars. Sewed them together. Even though Spoiler Alert, Star Wars Rebels is canon to those movies now, according to Disney, and Maul's dead. Oh, no. Can Obi fucking Spoilers! <laughs> Obi Wan fucking murdered the shit yeah, out of him. But, yeah, yeah Obi Wan did murder the shit out of him. Yeah, he did. In, in the movie. He came back. Oh, he got murdered again? Yeah, because he went and Obi Wan like bang the block block slash, and he's just like, I was not prepared for this block block slash. That's how you defeat a Sith Lord. Yeah. Um. All right. So yeah, whatever. They showed multiplayer. They showed like thirty fucking minutes of multiplayer, and it wouldn't have been bad if they didn't have the three commentators they had. Oh boy. Two guys. I don't know who they were. They were fucking annoying. Um. And then they brought in I just I heard about that. If you want to bring in I Justine for your conference, you might as well be signing like conference suicide oh because God. signing off on it because you're just like, well, I guess we don't care anymore. Here's I Justine. Maybe that's what no with gaming ass. Maybe maybe we found maybe we found what happened to the teleprompter earlier. He found out I Justine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I wish they t unplugged the teleprompter, but um, they had teleprompter there too for oh. when they were watching the live gameplay. Oh, good. Uh, cause you could tell, like, I Justine's not talking at all, and then there's a part where, uh, she says something that's obviously written down, 
like because it was pretty much advertising the game Shocking. or whatever. It, it was it was horrible. At, at that point, all I did with my stream chat was like talk about. I don't know. I, I, we talked about like random shit. We were just talking like about. Oh, we talked about Batman v Superman. Oh, we talked about weird shit. Like I was talking about how Batman v Superman is a shit movie and <laughs> all this what stuff. What do you mean? It's amazing. Yeah, that's, that's someone in the chat was saying that. That's why I, I had to talk about it. But I talked over that entire thing because I didn't give a flying fuck. I didn't even make a highlight video. He made highlight videos for all these things. He didn't even do, didn't that, even do that one because I knew it would get shit. So I was like, fuck it. Um, it, it. It looks like Battlefront one except better a little. I, I'm looking forward to the single con- player, and we didn't get to see any yeah, of that. Uh, at least we actually have more content than, what, four game modes and four maps and yeah. an extra map this and time DLC? You get, you get five game modes and, and three and a half maps. <laughs> three and a half That's maps. actually less. <laughs> well, they're bigger. So. Actually, no. Technically, it's even now because you got the extra game mode. That's true. Yeah, yeah. And you got single player, too. Yeah. Imagine single player is just like, uh, all right, defend this point. Is hordes? Isn't it the same mode as, from Battlefront One? It is. <laughs> I never. No, played it's even that. the same mode in multiplayer. They kept the same mode. Except, except you have a girl talking to you like, "Hey, I'm 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 part of the dark Kill side. Kill Luke Skywalker. Kill Luke. <laughs> this okay. Is supposed, to be, supposed to be. Yeah, I guess it's supposed to be set in between six and seven. So. I mean, that's probably what the one of the trailers. Like she, what did confront Luke in one of the trailers? I don't remember. I, to be honest, like at this point, like, I don't, don't care. I don't it wasn't, it wasn't even in the conference. It was like early on. It was a month ago. Oh, okay. Yeah. I watched that trailer. I just don't remember. <laughs> I was excited for it, and now I just don't care. But um, thanks, EA. You made me not care about Star Wars. Yay. But, um All right, so that was EA. I talked about that way too long. But yeah, it was, I mean, it was, it was mainly shit. due to the fact that I have not watched the EA conference, so you had to explain it to me. Yeah. So, yeah. Yeah. All right, so all that's right. EA. On to the next one, then. All right.